said I can't find Desert where lost inside my mind Where the other pretty people who think they're right Well, I feel so sorry for them And now that day and it's all brand new Just wondering what I'm gonna do Well, I know that I'm gonna find a good party in time And you'll let me alone We are Piranhas BC I'm James, the vocalist Andy, electric guitar My name is Jay, I play drums My name is Jero, I play bass I'm Sean Paul, I play guitar The Sea Hike! Twenty years ago, it's a long, it's a long time Then I left the rails to and blow Ricky Long Line Used to be a hoe on the go Damn, you're twenty-nine Watching with your hands and your face is a point right Always yelling about money Give me some cigarettes from the door For me, it was a huge one growing up. Um, you know, I always liked, I actually liked a lot of, of metal stuff, but really got my fix the first couple bands to that, where I think really the punk is so much more fun than it just really is, and people seem to like it. You know, we don't clear Granny's out, we bring them in. So. Yeah, you should have seen them a few years back. Well, that's actually, it's a long way back with the long hair and painted faces and metal. <laughs> Which Jay likes quite a bit. I don't know about the painting no. faces, but he loves his metal. Well, I'm more of like, I don't know, I like all the old school stuff, Zeppelin, Rush, The Police. You know, big I think you bump, Even though you probably won't hear it I think you bump Sail, that song Sail, more than anybody else yeah, I know. I like that song. Bump Sail Away by Sticks. Sticks. It's a pretty good band. <laughs> That's Sean's favorite. <laughs> it's a big Sticks fan down there. Number one karaoke <laughs> song. You guys named them. Oh. No, you named them. Teenage Bottle Rockets, right? Yeah, they're, they're, they're all right. They're pretty cool. Oh. Yeah, they, they put on a good show. That's what I like. The interview they got. Uh, Rancid is another favorite. You know, social media. We got that in common, don't we? The police. He named that. I like that. 
And other than that, you know, I didn't even really, I think I bought like one album in my whole life, so. What is <laughs> I'm it? fresh to this music scene. What's the album? What's the album you bought? What's, What's the, the album, album you bought? Oh. oh, it was uh, Green Day, actually. They're do Dookie. Oh, oh could have been yeah, worse. Yeah. Yeah. So, so, yeah, we're pretty covered when it comes to the whole Facebook, MySpace, Twitter, um, Reverb Nation. I mean, that's all kind of linked together really well, where if you get on there and spend a little time doing it, it really is put out there. So you just Google this Piranhas BC and it tends to come right up. If you Google Piranhas BC, one of the returns actually has our schedule right there, which is kind of nice. come with a guitar part and we just all start playing it and James makes up the words and yeah. that's all there is to it. And I found once you have a solid guitar part, I've told a lot of people this and it seems to work for them too when I share it on, once you have that down the solid idea and I just uh, focus on a subject, you get a good subject going and then right away and usually we can have a song done before the drums ever even touch it, although that tends to sometimes then, change. Yeah, that some sense. of them show up all done, Sean will come with a complete song, lyrics and all, and so will I, you know, and, and James writes guitar parts, he sings them to us, he goes, ba 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 we have to learn to play it, you know, that works pretty good. And then everybody else just kind of makes their own parts for what the songs we come up with. Yeah, it's the arrangement that takes a little bit different turn. You know, how many bars are we playing this? How many bars? Where are we doing the break? What's a bar? I'm not sure what a phrase is. Either. You know, you know what I mean. A honky tonk. <laughs> a phrase. A measure. I don't know. A measure. measure. We actually just cut a little uh, five-song EP with Mr. Speedy Gray of Like a Rocket. Uh, he did a fantastic job for us. We were one of his uh, two kind of pilot projects, but he did a really good job. 
and we're gonna firm that up, uh, get that printed out, and probably you know have some kind of release party somewhere around town or something on that level. We'll really just get it on iTunes, get it out there. And I can't promise you anything.